together every day, having adventures as we play. Up in the hills, down on the beach, always a rainbow within reach. On Animal Island, on Animal Island, yeah. On Animal Island, on Animal Island, come on. Hello. to say hello 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 let's stop to say hello it's a way to say we're glad you're here come on and say hello hello hedgehog hello fox hello pig hello monkey when friends are near we smile and say hello when friends are far we wave and say hello it's a friendly word that shows we care come on and say hello hello mr frog hello hello, hello mr. mr goose hello hello friend Hello. Hello. Hi. Nice to see you. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> this song is about colors. Start with yellow, red, and blue. Yes, we do. Start with yellow, red, and blue. Now take two. Mix two colors and you'll make something new. Start with yellow, red, and blue. Yes, we do. You can also add a little bit of black or white. Yeah! <laughs> it's so good to see you again. The rest of the gang is already here. Let's see what Pig is up to. Hi, Pig. What are you painting? Can you tell what it is? A yellow sun. That's right. Let's see if you can guess what my other paintings are. What's this? A yellow house. Yes. And what's this? Hmm, it looks like a yellow flower. That's right! What's this one? That's a yellow wiggle bug. <laughs> Did you notice something about all my paintings? Look again. I painted a yellow sun, a yellow house, a yellow flower, and a yellow wiggle bug. What do they all have in common? They're all yellow. That's right! Today I'm only painting yellow things. Pig's paintings give me an idea. Let's make yellow our special color of the day. Pig, Fox, I'm going to show you a new way of painting. Ooh. Um, I don't see any paint brushes. That's right, Fox. We're not going to paint with paint brushes. Huh? Huh? We're going to paint with sponges. Ready to see what happens? Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. Do you want to start with blue paper or red paper? Hmm, blue, please. And I'll take red, please. Great! Now, pick up a sponge. Dip it in the yellow paint. <laughs> and start painting. Oh, 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 look! My paper is turning orange. Because red and yellow make orange. My paper is turning green. That's right. <gasps> Look how smooth it looks! 
I'm tapping my sponge. <laughs> it looks rough, like, like rocks. Smooth and rough are textures. Say it after me. Textures. Textures. I'm done. Me too. Let's hang up your paintings and look at them. What's something that's the same about your paintings? We both painted with sponges. That's right. What else? We both painted with yellow. Yes. And what's something different about your paintings? Mine came out green. And Pig's is orange. And my painting is rough, but Fox's is smooth. That's right. Now, what do we do when we're done painting? We go play! Uh-huh. But first... We clean up! Oh, right! That's right! Let's clean up together! Okay! okay. I'm crunching leaves! But only yellow leaves! I see one! Let's look for more! Let's look for one more! Do you see it? There it is! We did it! <laughs> Yay! See you! beautiful colors, like the color yellow. Yellow here and there, I see it everywhere. Yellow all around, in the sky and on the ground. It's story time! Yay! Gather round, everyone! What book are we reading? We're reading this one. It's called, What Does Anu See? Anu is a little girl who likes to observe things. That means she looks at them very carefully and notices things. I wonder what she observes. Let's find out. Let's begin. What does Anu see? Written and illustrated by Lavanya Kartik. Anu loves to look at things, things both big and small, houses way up on the hills, and ants upon the wall. Things in the kitchen, things on the shelf, things in the garden, things on herself. Anu sees patterns and shapes everywhere. Nothing at all can escape her stare. Spots on a ladybug, circles in the trees. Shapes made by people, shapes made by bees. Lines on a leaf, like lines on her hand. The marks of her feet in wet seaside sand. Waves in the water, waves in her hair, mushrooms on tree trunks, birds in the air. Words in a book that can take her to new places, full of new colors, new stories, and new faces. Things of the color that she loves best, red, like the three wiggly hairs on her brother Boo's head. 
Sprinkles on the cake Daddy baked today, And the stars that twinkle at her From far, far away. Rabbits in the clouds Floating up in the sky, Elephants in the shadows, Come give it a try. Anu is happy with all the things she sees. Do you see all the things that little Anu sees? The end. Thank you, Mr. Goose. Thank you for reading with me. Kids, it's time for a sing-along with Mr. Frog. Yay! Remember to say hello when you see him. Hello, kids! Hello, Mr. Frog! Let's sing If You're Happy and You Know It. We don't know that song. Ah, you don't know it yet. I'll teach it to you. I'll sing the first verse, then you sing along with me. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. Now, if you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it If you're happy and you know it Stomp your feet If you're happy and you know it Shout hooray If you're happy and you know it Shout hooray Hooray If you're happy and you know it Shout hooray Hooray If you're happy and you know it Then your face will surely show it If you're happy and you know it Shout hooray Let's do all three. If you're happy and you know it, do all three. Hooray! If you're happy and you know it, do all three. Hooray! If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, do all three. Hooray! That was splendid. Frog. Goodbye! Here's something we already did. Let's do it again. Hey, everybody! Let's practice our letters by playing the alphabet game. Yay! I want to hear you, too! Let's all play the alphabet game when I show you a letter, say its name. Are you ready? Yeah! What's this letter? K! What's this letter? V! What's this letter? W! What's this letter? Y! Now let's do it fast! W! Everybody. That's how you play the alphabet game when you see a letter. You say its name! Woo! The letter B! <laughs> Yawn! Y, y, yawn! <sighs> Y, y, yarn. Yo yo. Y, y, yo yo. Yam. Y, y, yam. Yummy. What letter do all these words start with? Y! That's right! The letter Y! Hmm. 
I see you. Hi. Whee! <laughs> Whee! <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Goodbye. And now it's time to say goodbye. Let's sing our goodbye song. Goodbye, goodbye. It's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye. Let's stop to say goodbye before we say hello again. We need to say goodbye. Goodbye, friend. Goodbye. Bye. Goodbye. goodbye. <laughs> time to rest. Take a deep breath in. Let it out. Good. Listen. Little Bo Peep has lost her sheep and doesn't know where to find them. Leave them alone and they'll come home, bringing their tails behind them. Little Bo Peep has lost her sheep and doesn't know where to find them. Leave them alone and they'll come home, bringing their tails behind them. Has lost her sheep and doesn't know where to find them. Leave them alone and they'll come home, bringing their tails behind them. <laughs> 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 